Hi, I'm Jason Dubendorfer, IQS specialist on the marketing team. Today we're going to talk about SQS software. Let's get started. And in this episode, we're going to add a manual acknowledgement button. In a previous episode, we've put the wheel. We've also entered a text box that says visually inspect the lugs for burrs. So now we want to acknowledge that step. So the operator has to push that button. What we're going to do to add that is come to the drop down on confirmation, click OK confirmation. Now you can see that there's a red box. Every time we see red, it means something needs to be done. So now we're going to go back and we're going to change this and we're just going to call this OK. You can see that the gray box with the OK is what you will get. If you want to change that image, everyone knows that I like the next button. So I click change and it will bring up the list of pictures that I have stored. And you can use any picture at all. There's end, there's advanced, whatever buttons that you want to use, you can use as long as they're in your uh, resource management file. I like the next. So I'm going to click OK. It's going to show up here as the button image. Click OK again, it appears in the upper left corner. I can drag it, I can drop it, I can resize it. I mean, we can make it as big or as small as you want. I like to make sure it's large enough for an adult hand to make sure that when they press that they can actually hit the button. So once you add the button, click apply so it's saved. And that is how you add a manual acknowledgement.